What's going on, Assassins? It's Dark Strider, and we continue the Taco Tuesday trifecta with Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Now, we're going to go and check in on Sargon. Hopefully, he gives us a good week. Then we're going to see what mercenary we're up against, and finally, what our weekly is. And of course, I'm going to show you guys the easiest ways to do this, as well as what the rewards are. But as always, we begin with Sargon. Let's check out what he's got. So he starts off with the top of the food chain, 25% warrior damage, 50% crit damage, 10% crit chance, and 50% crit damage while low health if you have the full shark armor set for 80 ore. Um, decent piece. The Greek hello, 25% assassin damage, 50% crit damage, plus 15% all damage, but minus 15% health for 100 ore. Now, this is a useful item. I strongly suggest you get it. Uh, we've used it in a lot of builds, and it's been awesome. Athenian Lintharax, 24% assassin damage, 50% adrenaline on assassination kill, 50% crit damage for 40 ore. Not a fan of the adrenaline on assassination kill. Uh, Corinthian Helmet, 24% warrior damage, 20% crit chance while low health, 40% chance to ignore half damage. I like everything except the uh, low health only because it really takes a while to get to like low health and like kind of fight effectively. Uh, then you could also get the Olympian gift for 20 or and take a chance at getting a better legendary or epic item. So going to our board, we have Blades of Justice and Okalia, the Lotus Eater, is our mercenary that we have a bounty on. Let's take a look at what these quests involve. And we have, of course, Okalia, the Lotus Eater, Blades of Justice, Assassinate Bandits, Kill Bandits with Swords, Kill Bandits with Spears, 10, 15, and 15, respectively. The uh, Bandits with Swords and Spears you could easily do at the arena. Assassinate Bandits, you may have to go around and go to bandit camps in order to assassinate them, which really isn't that hard. Now let's take a look at Okalia, the Lotus Eater. And here she is. Okalia's Lotus Dagger, 24% assassin damage, 30% damage with daggers, 40% poison damage. Now this is an amazing piece. I actually have two of them on a build that I did. Uh, it's a really fantastic dagger, and uh, it, you really do a lot of damage, especially if you have an assassin poison build, well, again, with daggers, which it has the dagger thing on it, which is amazing. So we're going to take a look at where Okalia is, and there she is. I'm going to go over there, get her, and then, you know, bring you guys in as they normally do. So there wasn't a lot of moving around and whatnot. It's pretty easy to find her. And what we'll do is we will take her out with the paralyzation arrows so that that way we're able to go and use her on her ship. And she seems to be putting up a fight. I really don't have a lot of uh, ability of ours going on. So this is going to be kind of like a wild fight. We'll see what happens here. And look at that. She came up from behind me. Don't want to actually kill her. I probably could have softened her up with a couple of uh, strikes, but don't want to uh, actually like hurt her, hurt her. We'll let the paralyzation arrows take their course, and then we will recruit. So in doing that, we got the awesome dagger. We also have 44 ore, again, because I'm the top tier mercenary. I get 10% more, which means 44 ore for mercenaries for ships for weeklies and uh 10 or actually 11 for dailies so here we go we actually have her in the legendary flavor i'm starting to believe that certain ones are a lot easier to get in legendary rather than in uh epic which is kind of wild and i don't think i have any epic versions of her but we'll take a look again i do all this just so that you can make like pretty awesome ship builds depending on who your lieutenants are it really adds a lot of extra flair to like your ship and whatnot so of course i want to do that anyway that's all there is for this video i hope you enjoyed it please make sure you like and subscribe it helps this channel out an awful lot as always i want to thank each and every one of you for watching and until next time Take care, be good, stay safe, take care of each other. 
I'll see you guys all in the next one. And you know how we end this. Always a Yai. Yai.